Fire was one of the major causes of death according to the annual crime report of 2018. Some of the victims were school students, including this one in Kalung district, where a number of learners were killed and property lost. After studying the situation, John Chibuka, a resident of Namasuba, has developed an innovation called John TFM Plus Fire Quencher, meant to avert fire outbreaks. Manya Secondary School. Uh, oh, it was an S3 dormitory where nine of the students perished in that fire and the, a number of them did what? Sustained very severe you know, injuries. So when I looked at that when I was watching on the TV, it really touched my heart and uh, I said now, what, why would a situation like this continue? Can't we find a solution to it? The machine is fabricated with a steel housing that protects the inner components of the extinguisher. It has a hose pipe that is connected to the water source and the 140 liter tank that stores water. There is also a hose pipe connected to the pump and outlet. He did not want the inner parts filmed to avoid replication. The machine runs on electricity, which could be a challenge in case of power cuts during a fire outbreak. Uh, still, we can have a, a power backup design for it, but uh, the concern is to do with the cost because it becomes more costly. When switched on, the pump will start pumping the water inside a tank, creating a lot of pressure. Chibuka demonstrated to us how the machine works and its effectiveness. John TFM Plus, which Chibuka started working on in October last year, can spray water up to the radius of 20 meters. The fire quencher also has light connected to it. No one can be able to see through that bill of the smoke. So that's why I designed a high intensity light. Joshua TFM Plus can pump 140 liters of water within just five minutes. I therefore ask Chibuka whether that is enough time to put out fire, let's say, like in a dormitory that is already engulfed by fire and everything inside is smoldering. The nozzle is adjustable to less pressure, ideal for irrigation of crops. Among other uses, the fire quencher can also be used to clean tall buildings. The machine is also ideal for spraying crops and plants affected by various diseases. We are having a problem of mangoes, which we are having on the market which look so good on the outward, but if you, are, you cut them inside when they are rotten. The pumps which we are having on the market do not reach those great heights. But what challenges has he faced? Mm, some of the challenges which I went through um, is acquisition of the appropriate parts which I require to use. The multipurpose mobile fire quencher costs 3.4 million shillings and is an ideal alternative for dealing with fire. Sudil Yarhanga, NTV Innovation Nation.